Let's make a shaken watermelon margarita. It only has three ingredients. Let's get started. It's hot outside, so let's make margaritas. Watermelon margaritas. Who likes margaritas? We're gonna chop all the watermelon. I'm going to blend all the watermelon in a blender. I have a small seedless watermelon here, and I'm just chopping it up and removing the rind. If I was using a larger watermelon, I would just cut up enough to fill up the blender. There you go. I'm making a shaken margarita today, but if you wanted to make a frozen margarita, throw all the ingredients into the blender with ice and blend it now. Yum. You can strain it if you want, but you don't have to. We're gonna shake it up. Fill your shaker half full of ice. Now we're gonna add it's about four ounces of watermelon juice. One ounce of freshly squeezed lime juice. One and a half ounces of tequila. Doesn't matter what kind, whatever kind you like. That's it, shake it up. Who needs shake weights? Make some fresh lime. Just gonna wipe that around the rim like this to get it wet. And then we're gonna dip the glass in tahine. This is a chili lime salt. Goes amazing with watermelon. Now we need some ice. Ice in your glass. And garnish with a slice of lime. Does that look beautiful? Look at that. Oh, gorgeous. Cheers. Mm, so refreshing. And the chili lime salt just adds that little bit of pop. Guzzle this on a hot day. We we'll laugh. Not a big drinker. Let's make another one with a slight variation. But this time, we're gonna take it to the next level. Ice. Another four ounces of watermelon juice. An ounce of lime juice. One ounce of tequila. And half an ounce of San Germain an elderflower liqueur. A glass of ice. We're not rimming the glass this time. That beautiful color. And garnish with a wheel of lime. Look at that. Isn't that beautiful? Mmm, wow. The Sandraman is kind of flowery, but it brings out this amazing flavor in the watermelon. Mm. That's so good and refreshing. Cheers. Thanks for watching.